You may not know his name, but you probably know his work. Actor Ron Cephas Jones recently went through a life-changing experience that left him wondering whether he would ever perform again. Vanessa Freeman continues our series honoring black history from our sister station, WPIX in New York. Veteran stage actor Ron Cephas Jones, who is also known for his notable roles on the small screen, is back on the boards in the acclaimed play Clyde's in a role written with him in mind. That's it. That's your response. Look, I'm not indifferent to suffering. But I, I couldn't wait to get my hands on the script. And once I read it, uh, obviously, uh, the character just just kind of blew me away. All of the characters, such an ensemble play, everybody. Uh, has a uh, part in telling this this magnificent story about redemption and about change and about growth and about uh, uh, freeing your mind uh, and, and living true to your dreams. A storyline that hits close to home, especially after going through a life-changing experience of his own. He received a double lung transplant in May of 2020. When the breathing problem started, you know, that's when I started to panic a little bit. I kept it under wraps. I didn't I didn't go public with it um, because I was afraid I may not be able to do a play again. Um, so to be here with you talking about it, it's, uh, it's a great, it's a great feeling. That wasn't Cephas Jones' only setback in life. He also fought drug addiction, homelessness, and discrimination as a young black man. I was afraid of a lot of things. You know, we grow up fearful. We live in a fearful time. You know, I grew up in the 60s, so you know, I was afraid to go down south, you know, I was afraid to go out in the streets because I would get, you know, I would get jumped or bullied or beat up. I was afraid to get good grades because people would say I was too smart or I spoke too white or, you know, we grew up with so much fear. He persevered overcoming those obstacles. It was actually my mother's voice. Um, took a while when I finally listened to it. You know, like I, I've heard it all my life, but there were times that I wouldn't really listen to it. Um, and it was her voice. I, I started to believe her voice and hear her voice. Not only did he make a name for himself on stage, Ron Cephas Jones' breakthrough performances on the small screen have been lauded by critics. From Truth Be Told with Octavia Spencer to his Emmy Award winning role in This Is Us, playing the biological father of Sterling K. Brown's character, Randall. A lot of these characters that I've played now, um, after being around for, I mean, I'll be 65 in January, so, I've seen a lot of life, you know, and a lot of men and women uh, have come and go. Family and friends and just people in different neighborhoods that I grew up. So there's a lot of source material that I can draw off, and William in particular. He is father to actress Jasmine Cephas Jones, one of the original Schuyler sisters in the Tony Award winning show, Hamilton. Every time I talk about her, I start crying. This actor feels very fortunate with his roles, both in life and on screen. Man, you know, I've been so lucky. And that was Vanessa Freeman reporting. One of the other actors mentioned in that story, you may have heard it, Sterling K. Brown from St. Louis, graduated from MICDS. Now to see more stories honoring black history, you can go to the feature section of our website, fox2now.com, and we will be featuring other inspiring stories throughout the month of February.